How to implement Google Login in PHP First, head over to the Google API console. Create a new project, or select an existing one. Then, go to the OAuth consent screen. Fill in your app information. The scopes can be left blank. Add your own Gmail account as a test user. Lastly, go to the Credentials section. Create new credentials for OAuth Client ID. Set Web Application as the type, and give it a name. For testing, we will set the allowed origins to localhost. Set the redirect URL to 3-login.php. And that's all. Keep the client ID and secret, we will use these later. Now that we are done with the account setup, we need to download the API library. First. Install Composer if you have not already done so. Then, open the command line. Navigate to your project folder. Run Composer require Google slash API client. Composer will automatically download the latest version into a vendor folder. With that, we can now proceed with the PHP scripts. For the first script, we will create a simple snippet to load the API library. Create a new Google client object. Set your client ID, secret, and redirect URL accordingly. Then. Request for access to the user's email and profile. In the login page, we will begin by starting the session. Redirect the user to the home page if already signed in. Insert a Google login button using the create auth URL function. On login, Google will return an auth code. Use this code to get the access token. If there are no errors, Set this token in the session and redirect the user to the home page. Else, display an error message on the login page. In all protected pages, Check if there is a valid session token. Redirect to the login page if the user is not signed in. Load the Google client once again, check for the validity of the token. If the token is expired, we unset the session and redirect the user to the login page. Lastly, we can also get the user's profile from Google. To log out, simply start the session again.
revoke the access token and clean out the session. With that, we have come to the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more.